So in the phone conversation, Tony and Lily, they are discussing. They are discussing some matter. So Lily is saying, talk to you later. Why is she saying, talk to you later? Why isn't she saying, see you later? So talk to you later is a way. This is equivalent in a phone conversation or a mobile conversation of saying see you later in a regular face to face conversation. When Tony and Lily are together in front of one another, they'll say, OK, see you later. But when you are in phone or mobile, you'll say talk to you later. Talk to you later. This is a subtle and a good way to say bye bye also. There are other additional similar phrases like thank you for your time, have a great day, bye. There are three parts in this uh, sentence. For example, thanks for calling, speak to you next time, have a good day. First thing you are thanking. Second thing you are, you know, saying have a good day or uh, have a great day or good day. That is you are wishing good for the other person. Third thing is you're saying bye bye or speak to you next, next time or talk to you later is saying bye bye. You can always say have a lovely morning, afternoon, night. So this is this is somewhat informal, especially to your to your partner, girlfriend, or your friend. You can always say have a lovely morning, afternoon, night. I will talk to you again soon. Bye for now. That means you intend to talk again and in a polite way you want to say bye bye. Sometimes in uh, American uh, English, in movies also you'll see, I gotta go. So here I want to say I have a meeting soon, so I have to run. In American English, we generally say I have a meeting soon, I gotta go, I gotta run. So this gotta is simply the short form for got to. Gotta is got to or you can say it is simply have to.